My name is Helen and I'm a resident in anesthesiology and intensive care. I was born in the UK, have been educated and worked both in the UK and France and I'm currently working in the emergency department in the Isle of Man. My experience in Covid intensive care units made me think about life and death and the importance of optimism in difficult times. In May this year I will be attempting to summit the highest summit in the world, Mount Everest and donate the excess of the funds I raise to medical research in virology. As Stephen Hawking once said, however difficult life may seem, there is always something you can do and succeed at. It matters that you don't just give up. As a doctor, I see the importance of supporting healthcare and medical research, not only in the short term, but also in the long term. I'm supporting the medical research of Hepatitis B by the international team ICEHPV, a coalition of renowned scientific teams who have a goal to cure HPV within a decade. Despite an infection vaccine, there are still over 250 million chronic carriers of the virus worldwide. I was fortunate to intern in the medical team of Professor Zulim, who is the chair of this organisation, which is supported by the World Health Organisation. I've always loved challenging myself. Sport is a great way to keep developing yourself and push the capacities of the human body. I've run several marathons, triathlons, competed in Ironman, and done increasingly higher summits. The latest was the Lenin Peak at 7,000 metres high. So now I've chosen the highest summit at 8,849 metres. I've asked the support from top athletes of national teams whom I interview through my YouTube videos and also from the press. I'm still looking for companies who wish to sponsor this project and show their logo on top of the world. And you can also follow me on social media and there's an individual's donation website for medical research. Check out all the information at www.inensolivarest.com Despite all the troubles of this COVID period, this project is about adventure, dreams and about hope. We must never lose hope.